yeah, that's right. Do 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 bam 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 bam. Haven't I killed everyone out here yet? There's that Mormon fort to the right. Oh, is this the Mormon fort? Yep. Hello. I have two girlfriends. I'd like to marry both of them. I'd also like to add her to my Hello? group of f girlfriends. Yes. Are you available? When people have got nothing left, they can always turn to the followers. When people have nothing left. They can always wear. Uh, Hipster glasses. Hey, are you a punk doctor? Are you here to drop off <laughs> medical supplies? I need some help with, uh, I got the hu the human paprika virus. How do people get infected with STDs, mother? The diseases are transmitted during sex intercourses, hence the name. The chance of getting infected depends on the carrier's level of infection and recipient stats. Roughly speaking, if you have high intelligence, perception, agility, and enough knowledge of medicine, the chances of cathing the bug are pretty low. What does cathing mean? Is there a way to avoid being infected, Julie? The best way to avoid catching the bug is to use clean, checked partners and stop sleeping around with random strangers. You fucking slut. <laughs> God, she cured my HPV. That was the worst. Now I can finally do it with my lady friends. <laughs> Let's talk about Freeside. What did you want to know? Uh, 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 things seem pretty rough here in Freeside. More than rough. It's a damn mess. What, what are we supposed to be doing Freeside, here? A few souls here in Freeside could be great assets to the community. If they'd kick their Oh god, I gotta clean some we bitches up, huh? So I'll see what I can do. So bring them I wanna talk. What do you wanna talk about? Shush. Some Don't talk to me anymore. Hey, Troy! What is it? Can't you see I wanna be left alone with my friend okay, here? Okay, that's gross, dude. I don't care what you're doing, but the king asked me to look into your attack. Well, it happened at night, around 11. Uh -huh. We'd recently made some caps off a bit of scrap we found. Yeah, yeah, I don't, I don't need the backstory, but fuck. I was mostly face down in the oh, dirt. Oh, okay, for that's too much that information. Happened, so I only got a quick look they, at them. I only got a quick look at them. They looked a lot like, they looked really brown, and they sort of like were in piles, and there's ants coming out of but them. But my face was in the dirt, so. So I couldn't really see them, but that's what, to me, what in the dirt, that's what they looked like. I hope you find the bastards that did this. Uh, if you want. I'll ask Wayne. I'm gonna ask Wayne. Wayne. That true? Did the king really send you? Of course he did, man. Uh, the king, he sent me. I'm the best. My name's Fap. I don't really know what else I can add. There were a bunch of guys. Better dressed than most freestyles, doesn't fucking guess, help me at all, you stupid fucker. Well, I don't know anything else. Sorry. Hi. Howdy. Ew. There isn't much to do around here. Yeah. Yep. Well, you could go ghoul lynching. Oh, wait. She well, probably is not too into ghoul lynching. You never know. Fun. She has a cowboy hat. Bet you've seen a lot over the years, if you know what I'm saying. Yeah, <laughs> you're I've old. I've been around long enough to observe the patterns of human behavior. Physical and mental anguish are especially exciting to explore. That's gross. Sounds like you're a bit of a dom, Beatrix. Hey, who doesn't enjoy a little pinch and squeal every once in a while? Oh, gross. Wow. That's wow. really gross. Let's talk about Holy something crap. else, please. What do you have in mind? Anything but pinch and squeeze by a fucking decrepit piece of shit like you. Longing makes the heart grow fonder. Uh-huh. But I've always been a fan of hogtying my lovers to make sure they can't escape. Wow. She reminds me of my grandma. Always full of friendly advice. Time you enjoy wasting isn't wasted time. Hey, I've got one. Um... Uh, distance makes the heart harder to hit with a sniper rifle. <laughs> That's a good one. That's what you meant, Beatrix. Uh, what about the kings, though? What about them? Pretty much the sort of gang you'd find anywhere else. The king himself, though? Yeah? He's got that something special you can't put a finger on. Yeah, he sure does. Too bad he likes girls with skin. Yeah. Skinless women are sexy, too. Yeah, just like skinless chicken. Yeah. Sexy and delicious. But the skin's the best part of the chicken. I mean, everybody agrees on that. But yeah, and the skin's the Just, best part of the woman, too. Uh, I guess that's true. Wow, she's a kinky yep. little, little lady there. That's pretty fun. Hi. You hear about that band of crazy old ladies running around? <gasps> I hear they're real vicious when they mug folks. No way. Mugger old ladies? That's awesome. Did, did you hear about that vicious granny that rapes men? Maybe she's part of the same gang of grannies. She probably is the le the ringleader. <gasps> One of these days, you'll get what's coming to you. Oh, I already did from a granny, the granny rapist. 
Welcome to Fallout Arena. Tonight we have Ashley Bauer wearing the White Glove Society dress. Using a plasma caster against Kevin Evans. Look at him all decked out in his centurion armor, power helmet, and the purple axe of doom. They're going to be fighting several raging robots. That's a nasty looking face. Kind of like your mom's. All right, here we go. So far, Ashley's been sitting this one out. She just watches Kevin take out the robots for her and then start shooting him in the back. Oh, wow. Cheap shot by Ashley. Very unclassy. Well, hopefully Kaven can bring this back with his purple axe of doom. Well, that post is causing a little bit of trouble here. Oh, oh no. But, but Kaven is circling around using his stealth abilities or something. <laughs> Not sure if that's going to work out for you, buddy. But Kaven really taking his time. Very <laughs> relaxed here. Doesn't seem worried. Apparently just having a weird hybrid uh, mix of armor is really uh, protecting him here. This isn't a fashion show here. No, you this is a deadly arena. I know that you prefer dresses, Emery. Ever since I was a little boy. Gosh, I wish this fight was over. Oh, it is! <laughs> Ashley explodes! <laughs> Victory to Kevin Evans. Go to subbable.com slash Game Society Pimps and support the pimps. What's wrong with wearing a dress? Oh, oh, Where is that coming gross. from? Quiet down. Make it stop. Oh, it's probably the king. He's probably uh, having sex with his two lady friends upstairs. Yeah, you're right. For he some reason, that. he pipes the sound down to the bottom floor. If, if I was the leader of a gang of droogs, I would have constant sex and everybody would know it. No, you wouldn't. Uh, yeah, I would. Hey, were you just having sex? Because I heard you. Done already? That's quick. Were you having sex with him? All I do all day is read magazines. Uh, He'd be amazed what you can learn from them. It sounded to me like you were just getting screwed. <laughs> so, uh, anyway, how about some sex? Yeah? All right. Awkward. Yeah, are you reading my mind? She assessed the situation and chose to walk away. What kind of treats does Morgan Freeman like? What kind of treats do you like, boy? Sweet poon tang. Oh. Oh. Is there something wrong with him? Like, he maybe talks like Morgan Freeman? He's been acting peculiar for some time now. I took him to the followers and had him checked out. And they said his brain is bad or something. Bad? Dude, he talks like Morgan Freeman. It's so cool. What are you talking about? Can I help somehow? Like, take him off your hands or, you know, steal him? I don't know. Maybe. If you found a way to help my poor Rex here, yeah. I'd be much obliged. Oh, of course. Your best bet would be to talk to Julie Farkas over at the old Mormon fort north of here. What was taught here? As far as we can tell, the guy that built this place was considered the coolest of the cool. Oh, and taught Dave Coulier? Frank Lloyd Wright? Edward Didn't James Olmos? Around. Edward Scissorhands? Oh Robert Downey Jr.? James Brown? James Dean? Dean Martin? Martin Scorsese? Cesar Romero? Ray Romano? Matthew Broderick? No! Not Matthew Broderick. Oh, right, right, right. Can I, like, uh, join the kings? Whoa there. You haven't shown me you've got what it takes to be a king yet. What? If there's one thing I won't tolerate, it's lack of respect. No respect! <laughs> Stop farting. That's what I thought of everything you just said to King. Sure thing. Hey, Morgan Freeman, I'm gonna find the, the problems and fix everything for you, okay? I'll be back. Get out of here. Okay, yeah. sounds good. Julie Farkas, here I come. Julie Farkas, I bet you're dumb. She doesn't make eye contact, you notice that? It's what like, are you looking at? Something really creepy. Oh god, her. you're disturbing. The King said you could tell me more about Morgan Freeman. Rex? Yeah. It breaks my heart every time I see him. I know, isn't it amazingly a great? So great that it breaks your heart? No. Rex's condition is way beyond anything we can handle. Well, why? He requires brain surgery and oh, some Oh, come on. You can't do brain surgery here? There's got to be a brain surgery tent around here somewhere. Well, is there anyone who could do all that? There's an old scientist named Dr. Henry yeah. who reportedly specializes in this sort of procedure. Okay. Thank you. You've been so fucking helpful. No problem. Why do you have an old Atari con controller on your jacket? Yeah, I know, right? What are you gonna, what are you gonna do? Play, play Pac-Man? Yeah, hey, you gonna play Asteroids later? Yeah. Uh, uh, you have an Asteroid tent? Do you guys have like an arcade tent too? Cool. Probably, probably right next to the brain surgery tent, right? They have so many cool tents in this place. <laughs> <laughs> arcade! I found the arcade tent! Holy shit! I'm just a researcher. Not even a particular... Bullshit. You're the, like, <sighs> nastiest, most evil researcher ever. I know. Setting up all kinds of traps, I bet, in, these, in all these different tents for different adventurers whose name starts with L. And then with ink. What kind of research do you do? Oh, you know, finding alternative treatments for common illnesses and injuries. Uh, what kind of injuries and stuff? Cuts, lacerations, broken bones. Oh, yeah, that's stupid. Cock lacerations? 
Common cold. Wait, That's horrible. Oh, Take God, yeah, you should. I'm glad you help people with cock lacerations. How do you even get cock lacerations? Oh, uh, what happens is if you, um, have sex with a really, uh, sharp woman. Like a smart lady? Yeah, a really smart lady. Why would a smart lady lacerate your cock? Well, because she knows who you are. Uh, you don't sound too enthusiastic about all these cock lacerations. I'm enthusiastic about helping people, but Nihil Not with their cocks. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, so you're not gonna give me a meal. You quizzed me about a fucking meal here Ugh. that I can go get like some in some other city. Do you know how many calories I just burned what answering kind, those questions? What kind of fucking joke is this? Why do you stand over here in the middle of nowhere Evening. asking people fucking history questions? You stupid fucker. Boom! Click the screen to subscribe to our channel where you can watch more Fallout for Pimps or some Skyrim for Pimps. And go to subbable.com slash Game Society Pimps to support us. We got tons of cool stuff you can buy, or you can just set up a recurring donation. And we're always putting new stuff up on that store. So if you donated money and there's not something you want to buy immediately, that's okay. Because you can always buy stuff with that money in the future. Thanks for your support, and keep pimping.